Time now for News for Utah Sports with Dana Green. Well, this may be Kyle Whittingham's best team since the Utes joined the Pac-12 Conference, and people are taking notice. Today at Pac-12 Media Today, the Utes were picked to finish second in the Pac-12 South in the preseason media poll. USC was picked to win the division with 22 first-place votes, but the Utes, who have never won the South, got 14 first-place votes, followed by Arizona, UCLA, Colorado, and Arizona State. Kyle Whittingham's thankful for the attention, but knows they have to prove it on the field. We've uh, you know, been in the league, what, seven years now, so it's been a process, and I think we're, we're to the point now where, where we've, uh, you know, we've got more depth and talent than uh, any time since we joined the league. So that translates into wins. That's the, you know, that's the ultimate and the, and the bottom line. Now, Jack Tuttle is the highest-rated quarterback the Utes have ever signed, but make no mistake, Tyler Huntley is going into camp as the starter. A dynamic quarterback can beat you, you know, with his legs, with his arm. Uh, he's a guy that uh, probably took a few too many hits last year. We've talked to him, you know, at length about that in the offseason. Zach Moss and Armand Schein will anchor the running game, but there's not a lot of experience back at receiver, so expectations will be high for return missionary Britton Covey. He's had a pretty good time frame there to get himself ready and get himself up to speed. He looks great in the, in the uh, summer conditioning. Obviously, you haven't seen him uh, run routes and catch balls yet. We'll be able to do that next Wednesday. On defense, the Utes' secondary is loaded with Julian Blackman leading the way. And while they do have to replace three starters on the defensive line, having Gary Anderson back on the coaching staff should help immensely. You know, he's been at some high levels and coached you know, a lot of really good teams. Uh, done some really good things in college football. He knows what he's talking about. And it's like he comes out and like starts talking to the defense. He has the team's respect right away. Like he knows what he's doing. While the Utes were the only Pac-12 team to win a bowl game last year, they're also the only team from the Pac-12 South never to make it to the conference championship game. A streak they hope ends this year. You know, I've heard it over and over. We're the only team in the South since we joined the league that, that hasn't got there. But... But, uh, you know, we, we own up to that. We don't, we're not trying to hide from that. It's just something that needs to happen. And is, like I said, it's the next step for us as a program.